What is going on guys? What is going on 27 squad? Welcome back to another video and today we're gonna be talking about Miles Garrett and Mason Rudolph now yet we've seen memes upon memes upon memes and yes, they're hilarious They're hilarious, but this has some serious implications. That I do want to talk about I don't want to be the Debbie Downer or anything. We can laugh at the memes and all that. They're funny. Okay, they're funny uh, And also being that Mason Rudolph can't catch a break with his head being that he was out this year uh, Earlier this year with a concussion as well, which in which he had his face mask like ripped off So uh, in this case he had his whole helmet ripped off and used against him as a deadly weapon now if you haven't seen the video I'm pretty sure everybody has seen the video, but I'll put the video above uh, well on my my face and on the screen here uh, if you guys haven't seen it but to summarize it quickly may I, I mean miles Rudolph seriously attempted to murder Mason Rudolph um, and miles Garrett I'm sorry I, I, if I said Mason Rudolph or miles Rudolph I'm sorry miles Ma Garrett attempted to murder Mason Rudolph here and I think he just lashed out. I don't think he was thinking but I think he lashed out and I'll tell you this right now guys in on a serious note on a very serious note. We're talking serious. I Mason Rudolph had that helmet been flipped around and he didn't use the part where you know you put on the helmet it looked like he was trying to put on his helmet uh, for him but if he had flipped it around and used the crown of the helmet to hit Mason Rudolph the way he did I'm telling you right now, Mason Rudolph would have had brain damage and would never probably be able to speak again. I mean, that's how hard a helmet is. That And Miles Garrett is about, what, 270 pounds of pure muscle? This guy is one of the best pass rushers in the league. No no 300-pound man can, gra can hold him up. Andrew Villanueva can't do it. Nobody can do it. Mason Rudolph is one of the most powerful, strongest humans on this planet. And he's aggressive and uses his arms and hands very well and attempted to murder Mason Rudolph. I'm telling you right now, guys, if that if that helmet was flipped the other way, we would be telling a whole different story on is Mason Rudolph going to make it or not. I'm, I'm, I'm just being that blunt with you guys. And I, I mean, also, it also looked like a world star video because after Miles My Garrett went down, you got Marquise Pouncey just kicking him to death. I mean, this is not a good look for the NFL. This is not a good look for the NFL, and I'll tell you why in just a second. I'll tell you why right now. Mason Rudolph and other quarterbacks in the league next year, or maybe even maybe even going into the playoffs, they're going to be more protected than ever. I'm talking than ever. I'm talking not just star quarterbacks, because Mason Rudolph is no star quarterback. He's a backup quarterback at best. And, he, and, and what happened to him... He's going to be a lot more protected now. We're going to see a whole... If you thought if you thought it was a quarterback protected game now, wait till you see... And on top of that, Mason Rudolph started it. Mason Rudolph straight up went to Miles Garrett, tried ripping his face mask off. I don't know what the hell he was from. Well, they were getting blown out in that game. They had no success whatsoever. I guess he was just angry at that. But you don't mess with a guy that is 270 pounds that his job is to destroy you. His job, he gets paid by going after you. And you go after him, not a good look whatsoever. So he tries taking Miles Garrett's helmet off. In turn, he gets his helmet removed and is smacked in the head with it. Now, Mason Rudolph, and I'll tell you everybody that's been suspended, Mason Rudolph, surprisingly, not, is not being suspended at all. Not even fined. In fact... The NFL came to him and seen and asked if he wanted to press charges on Miles Garrett. By the way, news just got in. Mason, Mason Rudolph will not press legal uh, charges on Miles Garrett. I'm talking not NFL related. I'm talking court and stuff like that. Like, you know, it's court and um, judges and fines and all that stuff. Not NFL related. I'm talking about like actual crime cases. Okay, actual violence, actual assault. He did not, he declined to doing that because he knows at the end of the day, he's probably not going to win. You look at the tape. He, he provoked it. He started it. Miles Garrett didn't want any of that and did what he but did what Mason Rudolph was trying to do. Now, you already know the, the NFL is so protective of quarterbacks. They love their quarterbacks. And as you guys can see, you guys got, we got Larry Ogan Joby, who was fined $250,000 and suspended one game. I don't know about you, but $250,000 is more than I will make in about five years. So, uh, maybe even more than that. So, 
Um, yeah, nothing to joke around about that. Also, he was suspended for one game. That's a game check taken away from him, if you guys didn't know. So that's even more money coming out of his pocket because he's not playing in those games. That's a whole game check that he's that, that's gone. Um, so add the 250000 however and however much he's paid for one game, there, there's suffrage there. You then move on. You then move on to Marquise Pouncey, the Pro Bowl center for the Pittsburgh Steelers, who was seen kicking Miles Garrett. Now, he's the guy I like. He's the guy that I do not blame whatsoever because he didn't provoke anything. He tried stopping everything. But once Miles Garrett got, took Mason Rudolph's helmet off and hit him in the head with it, Marquise Pouncey went off. I mean, he went world star on this guy. He threw him down and started kicking him. Like like it was like it was a street fight. I it, it, Marquise Pouncey is the only guy I will give props to. I love Marquise Pouncey for that. Good job for sticking up for your quarterback, even though he provoked it. But good job sticking up for your backup quarterback that's been doing nothing for you guys in the past couple weeks. Good job there. Uh, and as you guys know, Mason uh, Mason Miles Garrett has been suspended for the rest of this season. Now we don't know what kind of fines are going to happen, but if two if Larry Ogunjobi got 250000 This guy, This guy is going to get in the millions somehow. I know he's still in, on his rookie deal. Don't know how he's going to pay for it, but he's got to do it. So there's that. He's also going to be uh, suspended for the rest of this year. I mentioned that, but I don't know if he's going to be suspended after this year as well. So you got all of, all of this season, the rest of the uh, games for the regular season. And if the Browns make the playoffs... It's not going to happen. Uh, but if the Browns make the playoffs, they are not. he is not going to play in that either. But that doesn't mean he won't be suspended to carry over next season. So we'll see what happens about that. But that being said, guys, my, my quick thoughts on it. This is a bad look for the NFL. Sure, was it funny at some point? And was it entertaining? Absolutely. But at the same, at the same uh, you know, perspective here, quarterback's going to be more, more protected than ever. And on top of that, Mason Rudolph could have nearly, I'm not even joking, could have nearly died if that helmet was just flipped the other way. Okay, so we have to take that into note. This is not a joke. Um, but, I mean, hey, you could crack jokes. You could make some memes. The memes were kind of funny. I'm not going to lie. But that's all I got to say. Uh, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Leave a like if you guys enjoyed. Subscribe if you guys are new. Remember to recommend any videos you guys want to see in the comment section below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. What? What? What you said, Miles Garrett? Huh?